okay, we'll go back to part eight of how to build Carnival Dream. We're moving on to the next deck. So it's the Promenade deck, actually. So this deck right here. So to start it, we need to come over here. Oh, not over here. What am I doing? <laughs> over here put a slab go 15 across and then your three two two one and then two more ones two blocks behind that and then 12 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 8, 11 12 that was not good counting and then a five, one, two, three, four, five, one. And then a two. And then a thirty-four. So stack thirty-three. <clears throat> and then a two, five, one, two, three, four, five, two in. And then here a forty-seven. So stack. 46 2 out then a 5 1 2 3 4 5 2 and then here have a 32 so stack 31 and then 2 and then five, one, two, three, four, five, two. And then have a 28 here. So stack 27. And then have your two, five, one, two, three, four, five, two. If I can place the block, let's go ahead and turn down my render distance. Not that. There we go. Now come in and have your 26. So stack 25. Then have a 2, 1, and then here have a 41. So stack 40. I do you believe it should be like that? It's not really easy to tell from there. Yep, it should be too short. That's right. Cool. We got it right. Okay. Back to the front. Put your blocks behind these. There we go. Now put your slab here. Go 15 again. And three, two, two. Then three sets of one. One, two, three. One block here. One slab here. One block here. Then have a 10 right here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Then have a gap of 3. 1 here. Let me mark that out as we go. Have a gap of 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1 here. Gap of 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1 here. Now you're going to do that six times. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. Should in there. So like that. Then have a gap of three. One here. 
Gap of five. One, two, three, four, five. One here. Have eight of those. So skipping five eight times. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Maybe make sure. And that should be it. So eight of those. And gap of three, one here. Do that three times. So one, two, and three. So like that. Then a gap of five. One, two, three, four, five. One here. And do that five times. So one, two, three, four, and five, I do believe. So there we go. Then have a gap of two, one here. Gap of three, one here. Then a gap of two, one here. Then a gap of five, one, two, three, four, five, one here. And have that five times. One, so two, three, four and five. Let me see. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe this one ends here. Let's see. Nope. So gap of five. Oh, that's a four, that's why. Okay. There we go, that's better. <laughs> My bad. Gap of three, one. Gap of four, one. One, two, three, four. One here. Gap of five, one, two, three, four, five. Do that four times. Two, three, and four. Gap of two, one here. That should be where it ends. It is, we're good. Okay. Hmm. Now you want to build all these up. One more. And then you want to connect in glass panes, black glass panes. And basically you just want to fill this in like this. Connect it like this. So do this for all these. Build it up to two and then we'll fly around it and look out and see how it should look after. So I'll be right back. Okay, so there we go. This is how it should look. I'm just gonna fly through this. It's a pretty simple design. It's about a bunch of patterns. Of course, you don't want it to look like this. So that is the side piece. Now let's go back up to the front and we're going to start the inside layers to make the wall for the inside. <laughs> so over here, put your block behind these and here. I do believe this is another floor right here. Let me check. It needs to go down. Okay. 
Okay, here we go. So put one, two, three, four. And a block here. Have this block go 15 wide. And then a three. And two. Get up your stairs. One connected here. Two stairs. Two coming back that are connected. And then here. I have a 148. So stack 147. Gap of two, one, two. So there we go. And then here have a one hundred and ten. This is a stack one oh nine. Just to make sure it should be three short. Let's see from here to here. That is right. Okay, cool. Let's go back up to the front. So up here, 15, 3, 2, 3 connected backs, 1, 2, 3, 2 stairs, 1 here, then have a glass here. And then have three. One, two, three. Like that. And then a three. One, two, three. And then a glass here. Let me mark that out. Have a ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Glass here. Then have a 16, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So there we go. Okay, let me mark that out. Then have a glass and a 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, gap of 2. Break those. Then have a 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Glass here. And then here I have a 51. So stack 50. Hold on, let me mark it out real quick. Just don't forget. So now over here, I have a 2. And you're going to skip 1. Do that 3 times. So 1, 2, 3. Go. Then have a four. One, two, three, four. And then two. Skip one. Do that four times. One, two, three, four. So like that. Then have a three. One, two, three. Two glass. One. Do this three times. One, two, three. Then have a three. One, two, three. Same thing again, so two, two, and two. Should be a three right here, one, two, three. It is good. Then here, have a three, one, two, three, two glass, one. Do that three times, one, two, three. Then have a three, one, two, three, two glass, one. Do that three times, one, two, three. Then have a three, one, two, three, two glass, three times, one, two, three. Then here have an eleven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Two glass, one, three times, one, two, three. And then a nine, one, two, three, four, five, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two glass, one, three times, one, two, three. And then here, I have a 26, so stack 25. And two glass, one, two glass, one. And here it should be nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And it should be one back, which means we got it right. Cool. <clears throat> which is what we want. So there we go. That's that layer. So now up here, right here, have your 15, 3, 2, 4 connecting back, 1, 2, 3, 4, 2 stairs, 1, 2 out, and then on top, well actually these aren't technically on top, nope, so technically not on top, on top of these, door and here is where it starts yep so here on top for the glass And let's continue filling this in. And then back here it should be an eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So one back, and then fill all these in. And then make your door. So there we go. So it should look like this. Now let's go do the stern real quick. So right here, have a one, then one slab here, and then a one, two, four, four, and then thirteen. Then going behind that. And then here, have a one, two, gap of two, one, two, one out. Right there. Get out your black wool. And have a, I do believe it's three behind, yeah. So one, one, two, three, one out. One here. And then nine to the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine. So there we go. Next layer, same as below, just in, in by one. So the same with the blacks. 
on here and then across the back if I can get the right box. Next layer, it's a one, then a two, three, four, and then the same as below. So there we go. So that is that deck for the outside. I'm gonna go ahead and set up the outside details as well. So we're gonna start at the back and we'll go to the stern from there. So go ahead and make that and I will get back to you to add in the details. Okay, so now for the front details. These little box you need. So black wool, spruce stairs, black glass, and rod dark oak stairs, hydrant head if you got it, oak planks, birch trap door, water bucket, <clears throat> glass panes, smooth quartz, and smooth quartz slabs. So right here, put one here, skip one, let's get out our regular glass, put one, two, one here, then for your bench, put one, two here, then one, two here, Put a glass here and here and a hydrant here. Now going down the side, come to this one, not that one, this one right here. What you're going to do, skip one here, right here and here, go across five. Then a two here and five here. And then go on top with your slabs. Then you're going to fill that in with your water once we have the floor, which we'll add in just a minute. Move on down here. First of all, get out your black. Replace this row, this row. Same over here this row right here then one two here and over here add an a three by three black wall so there we go same design here with your hot tub or spa or whatever you want to call it one two three four five and then a two five and two and slabs here and here and then over here skip two go out one two right here and go this way until you're three short from here so right there and then break these right here. One, two. Create like a door. So there we go. Okay, so that's all the major details. Now what we're gonna do is fill in the floor. So from back here, of course this is all normal. It's gonna change up on the side a little bit. So I'm gonna show you what that does. Basically, I'm just creating an outline just to help you out pretty much. So basically, we're going to have two wood. So one, two. So from this block right here, all the way forward, you're going to have white on the outside. So if we extend this all the way down. Let me check that real quick. Yep. So you right here, including under here.
So extend this all the way forward until you're here. So basically, create a wood line going to the front, fill up here. Basically, just whatever you can see, it doesn't matter too much. If you want to fill the whole thing, you can. So there we go. <clears throat> so extend this wood all the way down and make it all the way down so you have two wood and the rest is white. <clears throat> Through here you can fill these in. Actually no, don't, don't do that. So go ahead and add in your floors and I'll be back to show you how it should look. Okay, this is how it should look. <clears throat> so there is the floor added. Now what we're going to do is come here. And we're going to add some more details right here. Hold on, let me move around. So we're going to get out our spruce and rod and trap doors and the first two go right here skip one same thing here don't break that that's not what you want to break and rods and rods trap doors so there we go now over here one two one, two, and you're gonna have three. So one, two, and three. And rods, and then add your trapdoors. Okay, last thing to do on this for the details come down here and just surround the back with your glass panes. So there we go, that is the exterior of that deck done. Now we're going to add in the outline, so go ahead and build all that on the other side. And then once you're done with that, go ahead and add on this outline, which I'll fly over. So go ahead and add the outline. Some of it's right on top, some of it's not. So check that out, make sure you have it right. This part's a little bit weird, so I'll let you see it closer for a little bit longer. Now we'll fly back again, so you can get a closer look. Of course, they're not supposed to have that open like I do. <laughs> that was just something I didn't fix. So there's the outline. So go ahead and add that, make the other side, and then we will be back to start the inside of that.
deck. I don't know why I was going so slow there. <laughs> okay, now do the theater. Come down here. You're gonna replace this right, right here with your red. And then one obsidian, diorite, and then your red, another black. Same thing over here. So there we go. Now get out your stone. Right here. Put one, two, three. Then go seven wide. One, two, three. One, two, three. Then have a two. One, one. Then have that go back, fill that in. And then go up again. This time we're going to have a five. One, two, three, four, five. Then have a nine wide. And then a two. One, and then this connects in should be on the outside these build up and then fill this in and then go on top Over here, build this up. So there we go. Now below here, break these three. And have that going here. And then these. And then three here. And then down here, make a pattern with your buttons like this. So it should look like that. And for the last detail, let's see, I didn't search for that. Search lamp. Put one here, 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 and here. So there's how that should look. Next, what you want to do, replace this with your obsidian. This row right here. Okay, now with the back wall, you can replace this if you want, but you don't need to. So here you're just going to make the wall. Then build that up. And then around the back. For the floor, fill it in with your stripped oak wood. So right here. There we go, there's the floor. So it looks like this now. 
by using your stairs. Put three here, three here. <laughs> then beside that, and row going all the way over here. Should connect into this wall. Then you can turn one this way so you can see that gap. <clears throat> so like that. Now get out your end rods, trap door, and stairs. Put one here. End rod here. There's gonna be a cobblestone wall that goes up here. Not cobblestone, but a wall that goes up there. And then I don't really know exactly. So it's five and then one. And then the others are five and two, okay. So one, two, 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 three, four, five, one. Skip two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> one. <laughs> Basically they're making the same then two. Same thing here. And then here, and here. Add in your uh, trap doors. Now we'll surround this. Not pants. Don't know what that is. Go ahead and surround this. And then for the walls, let me see. You're just gonna continue these up from below. So one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And one, two, two. And three. And then here, there's not one there. There is one here. One, two, three. So that's how it should look. Now for the roof. Let's see. It is made out of polished black stone, I do believe. Um, yep, polished black stone. So right here. Go across. And then fill that in. So fill polished underscore black stone slab. There we go, there's the roof added. So your theater looks like this. The last thing you need to do. <clears throat> Add some lights up here so that it would not be just completely dark inside. <laughs> so there's the first room done. Go ahead and flip that over. And then we will move on to the next area right here. So go do that real quick. And I will be back <clears throat> to start the next section. Okay, for the elevator. Right here, I can miss some blocks, so build this up. And then add this, don't flip that over. Same thing here. And then here, red, 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 red. One here, then your pattern. Red one. 
I never flipped it over like I was supposed to. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> we'll fix that in a minute. Then go around that with their white. I'm supposed to have a wall here and here. So that's why that's like that. So let's go ahead and add on a simple ball right here, just so we can place it here, just so it's here. And then here. Same thing here. around this so like that <clears throat> now continue your pattern here in between Don't do that, that's not good. So there's the floor. Now go on top of here. And then here, this wall right here. Over here as well. So now go ahead and add in your dark oak and your spruce for all those. Put your wall here, 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 and here. And then your banners here, here, not there. Here and here. Build that up, add your roof with your slabs, add your end rods, your logs. And then for the stairs, place two right here. Then fill it in. So go ahead and make all that, and then I'll be right back to show you how it should look. So I'll be right back, okay, for the next section. Come down here, and you're going to build up right here. All the way around here. By the way, this is the new little design here. I had to change up the little, little left side a little bit, so this is how it looks. So go ahead and go on top. And then here, go on top of these. And then here, 
all the way to here, on top of here. here and back around here. <laughs> so there's the outline. Now what you need to do, go on top of that with your stripped spruce. Or no. Yeah, stripped spruce logs. this and then surrounding that over here make a wall and then have gray terracotta coming from here and fill this in going all the way around so this goes over to here through here same thing over here with the wall, right here, so now I'll build that up, fill that in, and then I will be back for this next part. So go ahead and do that real quick, and we will move on. Okay, there we go, there's the floor. Now what we want to do, replace your, uh, your stripe box with your oak or stripped oak so here around here also here's the stairs it's not the best way to do it but I'm sure you can fit you can probably fix it up if you would like not do that and now build this wall up over here build your glass up And then build up this block on the outside. So like that. Now create an outline using your glass panes. So there we go. Now using your lamps, if you got it, of course. Put one here, 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 and here. And then one here, here, and here. And then one here, and skipping one. Finish it here and here. Same thing over here. Well, this side's a little bit different. So right here, and here. So that's how that should look. So that's the atrium area done right there. Now here, there's a door here, here. Two, two. And then here, make your door and then fill the floor in with your sandstone feel free to replace the blocks So 
fill it up all the way to right here. So go ahead and do that real quick and then we'll move on to the next section. So I'll be right back. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Next video we will start here with a casino and then move our way back. So we have to do the rest of this deck for the next part. Shouldn't take too long, hopefully. So we'll cover all this in the next part and then we'll move on to the next deck. Which is the first passenger deck right here with crew or balconies. So go ahead and do all that. Add in whatever you need to finish it up. And then we will move on to part 8. So I'll see you next time. Hope you enjoyed. And remember to let me know if there's anything that went wrong.